I want to start doing some pranks at the car stores. So I'm trying to get some ideas. If y'all can give me some ideas on what y'all think would be some good pranks to do at the car stores where it won't put me in jail, let me know. Let me know what y'all think would be funny to do at a car dealership to prank the sales guys or the managers, something like that. So anyways, what is up with y'all BMW drivers, okay? If you drive a BMW, let me know. I got one right behind me right now in this uh, X, looks like an X3, X5, something like that. Anyways, the dude's got a shaved head, sunglasses on. He looks like he's crazy. I mean, it's just the way he's staring at the vehicle here that I'm in. I don't know. Anyways, but why is it BMW drivers always seem to be dickheads? Please, let me know. If you're a BMW driver and you're not that type of person, congrats to you, man. I mean, keep be cool, you know what I'm saying? I mean, you drive a kick-ass BMW. Why you got to be such a dick, you know? Anyways, that's just how I feel because it seems like all the people that I've ever ran into that drive BMWs always seem to be jerks or they think they're better than everybody else or something like that uh, what's y'all's opinions have you ever met a bmw driver that seems that way let me know in the comments let's see if we can get this bmw driver to come fly past us here and see what he looks like right anyways he looks like a real tough dude in there man anyways he was I mean, he was just kind of riding on my ass a few minutes ago and uh, I hate it when people ride on my ass. I mean, I wasn't driving like super slow like a grandma or anything like that. But for some of these people, man, they just act like they got to go and get around everybody. There he goes. Oh, the X1. And he must be number one. Also, let me know, you know, what are some of the most ugliest cars on the road that you think are ugly? Let me know what you think in the comments. Again, the most ugliest cars on the road right now in 2017. So they could be new cars or a little bit older cars. But I, I know, you know, back in the day there was a lot of ugly cars because the car manufacturers were trying to, they're just trying to make that mold and be different, you know, like that, that Aztec vehicle back in the day. You know, that was an ugly one, wasn't it? Who made that, Oldsmobile maybe, or <laughs> GM? I, I, it's gotta be Chevy, or G, it's a GM product, I believe. But anyways, that was not the most attractive car in the world. All right, that, that probably is the ugliest car in the world, the Aztec. Um, but yeah, what are some of the ugliest cars on the road today that you think? I personally think a lot of the car brands out there nowadays, they um, definitely, they all look pretty good for the most part. But uh, there's got to be that ugly duckling somewhere. There's got to be just that one or two cars in each car brand lineup that are just really ugly. Which ones are they? I don't know. Let's figure it out.